On February 15th, we released a new version of Firewall App 1.44. In this video, we are going to give you a quick overview of what's in this release. Inspired by your suggestion, we added device shortcuts to the main screen. Here is how it works. Go to a device view, scroll to the bottom, tap Add to main screen. You will see a shortcut appear here. Now, your most often used operation are just one tap away. Also, you will see a device shortcut labeled Recent. This shortcut is automatically created if you have changed something on a device or view that device network flow. You will change as you interact with different devices. You are limited to a total of three shortcuts. Firewalla is now also app aware. You no longer need to go through hoops to figure out underlying app's domain address. You will see a list of the app blocking buttons in the device view. With just a tap, you cannot block kids to watch YouTube for one hour or permanently. If you tap the app control button, you will see more apps. Or if you want more granular controls, you can do that in the rules UI. Here. You can find the app list. We will add more apps to this list in the future. If you own Firewall Gold, you will see this app awareness in Smart Queue Management. Say if you want to improve Zoom meeting by making it higher priority on the network. All you need to do is go to Smart Queue UI, create a new rule, select Zoom app, set the priority to high, no upload and the download limit. In this release, we also significantly improve the flexibility of routing traffic on your network. One of these features is the policy-based routing, or PBR. PBR allows you to send any type of traffic to any web interface. Uh, for example, you can send a gaming traffic to a low latency WAN and the video traffic to a web interface that doesn't have any monthly usage limit. Also in the next release, we will allow you to send any traffic to your VPN service provider. Finally, we made several enhancements in this release. Uh, one of that is new device quarantine can now be applied to network segment. Uh, with this, uh, we provide you better security. You can now do things like allows any new device to join your guest network, but to join your home network segment, it will be quarantined first. This function is on the firewall Gold only. The other one is rules can now be created with combination of IP and a remote port number. Uh, let's say you want to block all FaceTime traffic, but you don't want to block other traffic to the apple.com. You can create a rule like this. Select target. Select domain. Type apple.com column 3478. Right now, this is only supported on external services. If you host a service and want to control who can access it, uh, this will be available in the next release. If you want to know more, please see the release notes for details. Finally, if you like this video, please make sure to follow our channel and give us a thumb up. You will find in the comments section links to how to contact us, and we are looking forward to hear from you.